What's going on guys? So I'm back here today with another video. I got two things for you. I got another box of Ghosts in the Past. We're still in search for that Red Eyes Black Dragon Ghost Rare. Fingers crossed. And we're also going to be opening up some Lightning Overdrive. Uh, going to be uh, searching for that Black Rose Dragon Starlight Rare. And I'm hoping and I'm praying that we'll get it. So I'm going to pause the video, get everything opened up, and then we're going to get right on it. So one second. All right, guys, we're back. Everything's opened up and ready to go. We're just going to dive right in because I'm excited to open these up because I'm wanting some ghost rares. What I figured we'll do is we'll open up the ghost rare or ghost from the past. Hold on, just a second. One second, one second, one second. We'll open up the ghost from the past and then we'll do the lightning overdrive. So, whoops. There we go. So, we got Crystal Beast, uh, Rainbow Dragon. That's the first pack, so it's not bad. It's not bad. It's pretty good. But we want that ghost rare. That's what we're looking for. So, hey, look at there, guys. The Luber, the Jester Despia. That's a good one. That's a good way to start off the video right there. Uh, he's gone down in price a little bit, but still definitely worth sleeving up because you don't want him to get damaged because he is definitely a big time card right now for Yu-Gi-Oh! So, here we go. Bummer. Didn't get it that time, but that's okay. We got more packs, and we're gonna get it. We're gonna get a Ghost Ray. I, I feel it in my bones. We're gonna get a Ghost Ray. Oh, nice. That's a good one. I feel like the Ghost from the Past is really kind of like been on a little coaster ride these past few uh, few weeks. Kind of been going up and down. Hey, there's another good one. And uh, it's funny because in one of my previous videos, I actually stated that um, you know the Dark Magician Girl wasn't going to be worth like over three hundred and fifty dollars, and I still don't think it will. I think after the hype goes down, of course. Like right now, she is worth over that. But like I said, it's just the hype right now. But we'll see what happens. I'm excited to see the prices for all this because I feel like I think that some of these cards will actually go up in price. Uh, are going to do pretty decent. <clears throat> what I'd rather have right now. Well, actually, honestly, if I really had to pick between a Ghost Rare and the Black Rose Dragon Starlight Rare, I think I'd pick the Black Rose Dragon <laughs> just because I really like that card. And uh, there's a, that's a good one. That one's worth a few dollars. Or like a dollar fifty or something. something like that. It's worth a little bit. So I hope you guys are having a good day today. Be sure to subscribe to the channel. Smash the like button and comment down below on uh, the stuff you've been getting out of the Ghost from the Past or any other sets that you've been opening up. I'd love to hear from you guys. Also want to tell uh, say that I appreciate the uh, people who have uh, been uh, subscribing to the channel. We got uh, a few people subscribing to the channel. So I really do appreciate that, guys. Thank you so much, and I hope that uh, the channel is everything that you guys are looking for when it comes to opening Yu-Gi-Oh cards. So, once again, thank you so much. I'm very blessed. <clears throat> it has been a gloomy, rainy day today. Absolutely horrible day. <laughs> <laughs> it's been raining like non-stop and it's so humid outside oh it's it's just it's it's disgusting Ugh. i don't like humidity it's not cool come on red eyes black dragon where are you why haven't you shown yourself yet <laughs> got the cyber dragon uh pack See if we can get some good. Honestly, though, I gotta say, like, I have already pulled a ghost rare uh, from the uh, ghost from the past set, so I can't really complain too much. I'm very, very blessed, and 
I'm very grateful that I was able to pull the Cyber Dragon because, I mean, I have all the Ghost Prayers. I, I think, you know, obviously the two, the Raspberry Dragon and Cyber Dragon, are the uh, ones that I really, really want. But between that, those two, the Cyber Dragon is without a doubt the one that I really wanted. So, so just blessed and fortunate that I was able to get it, so... I'm very, very happy about that. Hey, the Dark Magician. Dragon Knight. He's worth like a dollar now. <clears throat> I thought that this was actually worth something, but I don't think... He, I mean, he's not worth the... I think he's worth a little less than a dollar now. Alright, last pack of the Ghost from the Past. Let's hope and pray we can get that last pack magic for this. Oh, the Mystic Sand. <sighs> Daggone. Well, can't win them all. <laughs> you know, I found it interesting, actually, that... Um, that uh, they talked about the pull ratios for the ghost from the past, and I honestly I feel like that uh, I don't know they made it sound like you were just like buy like a box you know a set and you were just guaranteed to get one. That, they really I mean I just feel like they made it sound like that. Well I probably should have mixed these up. Let's see if we can get that Starlight Rare Black Rose Dragon. And there's our first super rare. Honestly, I cannot remember all the cards from the set. It's been a while, actually, since I've opened this set up. Uh, if you haven't already, go check out uh, the other video of the Lightning Overdrive where I actually pulled the uh, Starlight Rare. Um, I actually ended up selling that card, so... <laughs> I actually bought this set with funds, so... Garden Rose Flora, another super rare. But yeah, like I was saying earlier about the ghost rares, though, they made it seem like everybody was just going to be able to just pull them like crazy, but I don't know. Like, I feel like, because I've actually opened a lot of the, of the ghosts from the past. Hey, that was the ghost rare we pulled out of the video, guys. And this is like a $15 Ultra Rare, so that's awesome. That is awesome. But, um, yeah, I have seriously, I've opened a lot of Ghosts from the Past. Um, I, some I actually, I haven't vi uh, recorded, and uh, some I have. So, it's just crazy because, I mean, I'm just, cr I've... Let's see. I think what is a ca uh, a case or whatever comes with uh, what is it? Twenty boxes, fifty boxes? I don't know. I've never bought a case. <laughs> but yeah, I've opened at least. I've ordered at least forty boxes. Of the uh, ghost from the past too, so little bat, and that means that uh, out of the forty boxes, I've gotten two hundred mini boxes inside of the box. So wait, did I do the math right on that? Forty, five, yeah, two hundred. Yep, mm -hmm. and it's kind of a bummer because. I don't know, like I said, I pulled that Cyber Dragon so easy, and I was like, wow, that was not hard at all, and I just, I don't know, I guess I just got this mindset that it was just, just gonna just be pulling Ghost Rares left and right, you know? It's starting to look like that that is not the case, because like I was saying before, it's kind of frustrating watching other people open boxes, because they're just like pulling, you know, anywhere from, you know, 
four to eight ghost rares, it seems, out of each case. But that's the way it goes sometimes, you guys. You guys know just as well as I do. Very nice. This is a $17 card. Last I looked. It might not be that now, but it is up there. That's a good card. So we got two good ultra rares out of this set so far, which is actually really good. It's it, it's almost those two cards have about paid for the set. We're almost halfway through the Lightning Overdrive, guys. So, just bear with me here. We're gonna get a, we're gonna get a Starlight Rare. Yeah, we just gotta believe we're gonna get a Starlight Rare. Just gotta believe it. <laughs> ZW Dragonic Halberd. That's an interesting looking card. After I get okay, yeah. After I open this last pack. For half of it, I'm going to move this stuff over and uh, move stuff over because this is getting kind of awkward to film it. Oh, there's a secret rare. And I got to be honest with you, I have, I cannot remember if that's a good one or not. I, I don't remember. I mean, maybe it is. We'll look at it in a minute. After we open the rest of everything. Alright, here we go. There we go. Now we're... Now we're good. So let's hope and pray we get a Starlight Rare on the left side. Nope. Got a Super. Starting things off with a Super Rare. Alright. I don't know what the pool like... What the pull ratios for these are. Can't remember. Tri Wait. Tri Brigade. Barebum. The Rampid Rampager. Jeez. That was a mouthful, wasn't it? <sighs> Honestly. You know, at this point, I'm I'm about I'm about three seconds from just telling myself to not buy any more ghosts from the past and just buy the Red Eyes Black Dragon card, and then just buying you know well you know like a few more uh, cards or uh, boxes, excuse me, to buy a few more boxes to like store away and uh, save for later. Very nice. There's another ultra rare. Actually, uh, I've pulled this one before. This is actually a pretty decent one. Uh, it's not worth a whole, whole lot, but I think it's worth about five. I think it's worth a little over five bucks, I think. I have to look it up. I don't have my tablet in here. So I'm a little unprepared right now. Come on now. Where are you at? Ghost Rare. I mean, not Ghost Rare. Starlight Rare. Started to mesh my... Box sets. <laughs> How crazy would it have been if we had gotten a Ghost Rare and a Starlight Rare? That would have been an epic video. Branded in white. I can't remember if that one's good or not. I like the artwork. I know that much. It's good. Got garbage all over the place. I gotta pick up. Oh, look at that, guys. This, man, I didn't realize that you could get, like, I, I, I didn't think you could get secret rare, two secret rares in this, huh? Okay. Well, I guess this is a awesome secret rare. It's not very expensive, but I love the artwork. It looks so great. It looks awesome. This has been a pretty uh, crazy box. Hoping we can get some some more good stuff. I also actually ordered a bunch of uh, Ancient Guardians 
Uh, I ordered three box sets of that. Still trying to find that collector's rare. Uh, big old dinosaur fella. <laughs> I'm hoping I can find him in one of the three boxes. And there is the big fish. Alright guys. So far we've done pretty decent. Can't complain. We got three packs left. And we're going to hope and pray. Hope and pray. That we can pull. A Starlight Rare out of these bad boys. So let's not lose faith. And another Ultra Rare. All right, look at that. White Knight of Dogmatica. I don't think that one's particularly valuable, but it is awesome to get an ultra rare. So, two to go. We just got to hope that this is one of those boxes that uh, has a little extra in it. Ah, super rare. All right. Last pack, guys. Let's get a little last pack magic. <laughs> and let's see what we can get. Because if I remember right, the last pack from the other side was the uh, secret rare, if I remember right. The one that I, I had never pulled. So maybe this will be the pack with the starlight. All right. Here we go, guys. Ah. Uh. Zexel, I think that's how you say that, construction. Darn. Oh well, guys, that's how it goes sometimes. You can't always get what you want. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Please, like I said before, subscribe to the channel for more great content coming up. We're going to have a lot of awesome box openings uh, coming up in the future. Like this video, uh, comment down below on uh, things that you want to see or, uh, you know, what things that you've gotten. Uh, out of any new or old sets, I uh, love to hear from you guys, and I hope you guys have a wonderful weekend. I will see you next time.